Looking for a three bedroom end unit townhouse in Plymouth featuring stainless steel appliances, master bathroom, loft space, and so much more? Well, we got you covered. Roll that intro. Hey, this is Michael Getty with Mozzie Properties, and today I'm bringing you a video walkthrough tour of 15592 60th Avenue North over here in Plymouth. This is of the three bedroom and unit townhouse behind me. We're gonna go check it out. Be sure if you enjoy the video, hit that like button and check out the description below where I post things like rent price, availability date, and, as, and links to that itself. If you enjoyed the video tour, but the house wasn't quite what you're looking for, be sure to subscribe to the channel where I post hundreds of other rentals throughout the year. Now, without further ado, let's get the show on the road. So, here is the townhouse. Nice end unit townhouse, two car garage right here. And because it's an end unit, check this out, this is kind of nice. A little patio space out here. And a nice green space. There's a little hill and I think there's a pond down there. Over here in Plymouth, nice townhome association. So you've got others in the area. Mailbox right down there. And I like the exterior curb appeal of these units too. Very nice. Two car garage with a garage keypad, exterior outlet, nice landscaping. And here we are. Let's go look at the unit itself. So, upon entering, come to this great open concept space down here. And you can see how it flows all the way into the kitchen. And how it extends all the way down here too so from an entertaining standpoint works really well we'll kind of just go through all this slowly here but we've got a large family room where you can go ahead and put a couch some chairs tv big windows looking off to the front with a little hutch here and it's entryway we've got because it's a end unit too we've got some side windows here and a patio right off the side we do have an overhead Light fixture here, so if you wanted to put a large table, this is a good space to do that. Otherwise, I mean, I would just probably do like a little high top here and then get some bar stools here and you can do a more informal uh, eating arrangement too around this large center island. Let's do a deep dive into the kitchen. We are replacing one of the cabinet doors here, so you see that that's gone. Should be back next week. We got really nice cherry cabinets. And then we have our stainless steel appliances, so here is our Gas range, built-in microwave, nice corner glass cabinet there too, stainless steel fridge, got a Lazy Susan right over here, because who doesn't love a good Lazy Susan? And then behind, with the center island here, we have the sink, as well as a dishwasher, there's some outlets on the side, vanity lights up above, and yeah, just a great place for entertaining and having people over. We'll show this side patio here too. So it walks right on out. Do have our AC unit right here, a little privacy fence. You can get some chairs or a table. Maybe get a grill out here. You can see others have kind of done that over here as well. And then, yeah, there is water down there, so a little pond. But if you've got pets or kids having access to this side area, really nice. So heck, even adults, you want to come out and play some yard games or, I mean, it's always nice to have some outdoor space. Now, before we go upstairs, I want to show the rest of the main level over here. So coming down this way, we have our guest bathroom. So there is a bathroom on the main level here. So you have company over and go ahead, use the powder room right here. Extending down this way, have our mechanical room. So we have our furnace, AC, water softener, and a water heater. And then a little bit of under stair storage, but not really much. And then we have a coat closet right here. And then lastly, here's the garage. I'll just show this to you. It's a nice two stall garage in here. There's a hose line over here too. Always nice to have that. Okay. 
So that's the main level. Let's go upstairs. Carpets are getting professionally cleaned tomorrow too. I just wanted to get things going with the video in the meantime. We do have carpet as we come up. And we've got this nice large loft space up here. So this can be, you, know, you can use this for a lot of different purposes. It's big space. Uh, you could have it kind of be an office area, quiet study, second living room, really whatever best fits your needs, but very large um, size up here. And then we have a shared bathroom over here as well. So here is the tub shower, toilet, and then sink vanity. And then we have three bedrooms. So the master's down here, the two secondaries here. Let's save the best for last and take a look at uh, the secondary bedrooms here. And these are actually really nice rooms. Good size, all have overhead lighting, nice large closets. Nice thicker blinds here too. Nice double door closet here, plenty of space for storage. We have the next bedroom right here. Here's our closet over here. Overhead light fixture again. Kind of cool, we do have in-unit washer and dryer as well. So that's right here for you. These do stay with the property. And then you got a little storage rack up above. And then the master bedroom. Overhead ceiling fan, master bath, walk-in closet. You might be saying, yeah, that's a, that's a pretty good size room. Well, it extends all the way down here too. So it gets way bigger. Basically kind of like two bedrooms combined into one. Uh, so you can kind of set this up in different ways. It, it works really well if you want to have an office up in your bedroom or a second like living space again, kind of like what we were talking about with the loft. But just a huge room here and you've got windows that run the back side here of the wall. One that's behind me too. Overhead ceiling fan. Down over here we have our nice walk-in closet. Then over here we have our master bath. Huge sink, double vanity. Toilet. And then stand-up shower as well. All right, well that concludes this property. If you have any questions, be sure to let me know. Otherwise, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye now. Thanks for watching our video tour. If you're interested in applying for the property, check out the video up here to see how to do our online rental application process. If it wasn't quite what you were looking for, you can browse our other active listings over here as well to see what else we have on the market. Otherwise, be sure to hit that subscribe button to be notified with any new content. Thanks so much and have a great day.